Okay. Hey guys, it's Lexi. Finally, Rosie's not and here. <laughs> this is my New Year's revolution, yeah. even though well, some of it might not happen. So, let's just get right to the chase. Number one. Study. I'm good with school. I'm, I'm really good with school. I get A's and B's in my report cards. But I'm just not that type of person that likes to study. I mean, I don't even think we should get homework because, I mean, we need a break from school because we have it, like, practically, like, most of the time. We have it five days a week, and there's only seven days. We don't get that much time of a break. And school is, let's see, um, September. Sorry. I counted nine months, and once in a while, school gets canceled so much it goes into July. So that's ten months, and we only get two months off. I mean, that's totally not fair. We should get half and half. Six months for school, six months off of school. I mean, it's honestly not fair. Why does school even have to be a choice in life? It's so hard. For me, anyways. I don't know about you. I'm in sixth grade, and I, I just hate my English teacher. I, I really hate her. Because, see, I, I, I had to study over the, the weekend, the little break for a wordly wise test when I get back on Monday. We're gonna have it on Friday. I haven't studied this whatsoever. And and I have until um, January 4th to study this and practically remember it in my head because I go back January 5th. And, and we have DRP testing, language, English, English, obviously. Like she said, we're taking the DRP, like, right after break. Oh, my God. Give me a break, woman. Honestly, she gave it to us um, the Monday before Christmas. So, so the 23rd was Tuesday. So she gave this to us on the 22nd of December. And I, I have until Thursday. Um, So the 5th is Monday, the Tuesday, the Tuesday, Tuesday is the 6th, um, Wednesday is the 7th, and Thursday is the 8th. So I had, that. that's how long I have to study, and I didn't study whatsoever, so, I mean, um, sometimes it's hard to explain the definitions of it, like, I know it, but it's hard to explain. Am I right on retrieve? I think I think I know that one. Oh, whoops! I dropped it. Never mind. But anyways, the school section is is getting um really overhand. So let let's just go to the next one. Number two. Work harder on videos. I'm literally like the laziest person with videos. Like for real. I mean the. I'm on script 10 for Stolen, yet I record, like, no episodes whatsoever. I'm on uh, episode 4. I'm literally recording episode 4. But the table I was recording on is very messy, so we got to clean that up today so I can finish recording on the table. And then I got to clean my table up so, so then I can record back in the set of where bosses for stolen so I got a lot of cleaning up to do so so like oh my god <laughs> and and I mean I know I have a new iPad and new iPod and everything but sometimes I am just so lazy to record and then when I record it I'm like I'm totally gonna upload this and then I like never upload it so I'm just like the laziest person with uploading and making videos even though I love to do it so, so, I just got to really work on that. I am talking so loud. <laughs> my parents are totally hearing all my problems. <laughs> I'm screaming so loud. 
Also, on that note, I need to really hurry with episode 4 because apparently we're getting kicked out of our house January 20th. So my mom is trying so hard to find a house. So we gotta clean this up really fast so I can finish episode 4 and then we'll see if I'll have time if I can make episode 5 here. If I can't, then uh, episode 5 will be recorded in my new house or apartment. Wherever the heck I'm going. I just hope the people we live with don't mind my loudness. <laughs> Especially when my friends come over. Especially Mia. <laughs> now, number three. Please focus. Number three, that sort of related to number two. Chores! I gotta do chores if I want money. <laughs> I'm probably like the laziest person with chores too. Like, like, if I showed you my table and the other table I need to record on for stolen, you'd be like, oh my god, you have to clean that? Yes, I do. Yes. But my mom probably doesn't want me to show you it. So I'm not going to, even if she would let me. And yeah. Just looking back at this table, I don't want to clean all that up. I don't want to clean it! I don't want to clean it! Help me! So I have to grab all my stuff that I want to keep with us when we move and put it in these totes so, so the totes will come with us and then all the stuff will, that I put in that tote will stay with us. And, and the stuff that I want to be put in a storage thingy, whatever the heck it's called. I'm going to put that stuff in there. And then we're going to put it in a storage unit, I think it's called. And we're just going to keep it there. And whenever I want something from it, apparently we're going to drive there. Even though we don't have a car. Or walk there. And then we're going to grab it for no apparent reason. like so. And the stuff that obviously I want thrown out, which probably won't happen, uh, I will keep or put it in like I you know I'll just save that for another step number four exercising yes I'm a wimp I am so horrible with gym and I have it when I get back it it's Tuesday and mama you said I had two weeks off I have 11 days off that's not two weeks so, anyways, like, I don't get how I get a pass in gym, because you either get a pass or fail. I bet I'm, like, on a 60%, 60-70, and I actually haven't attended gym a lot recently, so I practically kind of have to go to gym. So, we, we do these things called planks, like, where you, like, I, I can't really do it because I'm a little sweat shop right now. Like, um, we, like, we keep our feet, like, on the ground, and then, and then we, then our elbows are on the ground like this, and, and then we lift up, but the teachers say, not to let your butt lift up too high. Bruh. That, that makes it way easier. You're giving up. You're giving it to us the hard way. Anyways, so we gotta do that for 45 seconds. I honestly cannot handle it for, like, even 30 seconds. That That's how lame I am. And then, focus. And then we have to do it a second time for 45 seconds. In 5th grade, it's 30 seconds. But then in 6th grade, it gets, high, it, it gets to 15 more seconds. So it's 45 seconds, a second time. That's when I cannot handle it for even 10 seconds. So I am like the, oh my God. And then I'm like so like scared to play like the games in gym, just like, just like this. Just like we're playing like a basketball game and then just like uh, pretend this is a ball. And I'm like, kid gets the ball. And then I just watch them, and then I'm like, oh my god, they're right next to me. So I kind of, like, back up, and then they're just like, here, catch! And I'm just like, oh my god! And then I just, like, hesitate, and I do, like, this horrible throw. Like, like that's the basket, and I do just, like, this horrible throw like this. 
and then I get like so embarrassed. Okay, you can go now. And then like when we play dodgeball, Roger, I need you again. Then we play dodgeball, and then just like I get like there's a ball just hanging like right there, so I I just grab and get it. I, I like I like dodgeball, but I don't like most of the games we play. So I just grab the ball, and then I'm I'm just holding it, and I like back up to the back of the room. And, you know, kids run around. And then I'm just, like, looking at the kids, like, deciding where to throw it. And then just, like, one of the athletic kids come by, just like, Hey, Lexi, can I have the ball? Uh, sure. And then they take it, and then they just, like, throw it, and then they get out. That, that, that's what happens most of the time when, when I play dodgeball now. They, they usually get out. They, they usually get out. And, yeah. And, and just I just feel like saying it. Just like we have to run around three times the track, and I'm just, like pretend they're running, and I'm usually just like the last one in line. And then I'm like, oh my god, I feel so embarrassed and so stupid. So I try to run faster and faster, but then that makes me worse, and I start slowing down, and then the kids start passing me, just like loser. I mean, they don't say it to me. <laughs> And so they just, like, run along and run along. And then whenever the teachers blow the whistle, they want you to jog. So, right? No, no. They want they want you to um, walk. And then, then they're walking just, like, so slow because they're just like, oh, I'm so tired. And, that, and then I'm the one that passes them because I'm a fast walker. So I just walk fast ahead of them. And then, then we start running again. And then, and then, um... So they're there, then I, I start running, and then they pass me again. So it, it goes back and forth. <laughs> Number five. I'm going to go in the bathroom and say this. I kind of stopped being so damn scared of everything. I'm crying all the time. Well, not all the time. I'm, I'm very sensitive, so... Um... So I can cry easily. That, that's what it means when sensitive and I'm 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 like shy so I'm practically like scared to do everything not everything but mostly everything sometimes I just look back at myself when I'm going to bed and I, I just start crying because I, I just think I'm I'm just like scared of everything like I, like a water park, I don't even want to go to it because I'm scared I'll drown. I don't want to go in a plane because I think we're going to crash and die. I don't want to go in a boat because I think it's going to crash into something and we're going to die because, honestly, I can't swim. And and then, like, we go to an amusement park and I'm, like, so scared to go on the rides and everything. So then... I, I just want to stop being so scared of everything and so sensitive. Sometimes I wonder why I was made like this. <sighs> so, yeah. Going back now. Number six. Try new things. Honestly, I'm a very picky eater, so I don't really eat a lot of different foods. And I'm also kind of allergic to a lot. I'm allergic to berries because of the seeds. I'm allergic to um, caramel, I think it is. Yeah, yeah. Um, and the certain type of seafood. Um, what was it, clams? I'm allergic to? Shellfish. So, shellfish. I, I'm kind of allergic to a lot. <laughs> I used to be allergic to hot dogs. So, very allergic to a lot of things. So, um, yeah. I do really want to try strawberries, though, but I'm allergic to it, so I can't. I tried it when I was three, and my face got all puffed up, and I, and I needed to go to the hospital. Moving on! So, because I'm a picky eater, and I honestly don't think I will like it, because I honestly don't like anything, pretty much, when I try it. So, I just say, just like, no, thank you, or no, that looks disgusting, I don't want to eat it, or no, that smells bad, I don't want to eat it. Like, even if it smells or looks disgusting, I don't want to try it. Because I honestly think I will dislike it so much. And sometimes I get scared I'm going to throw up. Because I haven't threw up since I was um, four. 
and I really don't want to experience that again. I can kind of actually throw it pretty easily, I think. I've came close a lot of times. A lot. But haven't actually in, since I was four. Which is amazing and awesome. <sighs> so, yeah. I don't know if I feel awkward right now. So yeah, I think that's about it, guys. Um, I, I I don't have a lot of things because the things that I listed have a lot of meaning into it, pretty much. So that's why I don't have a lot. So, yeah. Ooh, what am I getting? get a lot more LPS. Never mind. Never mind. Sorry. I'm just like so tempted to get an LPS lot recently. I'm sorry. <laughs> so, um, I hope you enjoyed this video. And, uh, see you later. Or should I say, see you next year. Ha 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 ha. Random dog girl. Subscribe. That joke is so classic.